everyone. Welcome into Patriots Press Pass. I'm Mariah Jonas, joined by Evan Lazar. We're talking to Keel Harry this evening. Um, so a, an article was recently published that talked about Nikhil Harry's trainer and some comments that he had made in regard to Nikhil Harry's production production this season. Now you have a relationship with that trainer. You were able to speak with him uh, not too long ago. And what did, what did you get out of that conversation? Yeah, so I spoke to Rashad Whitfield, AKA the Footwork King for people that might not know his real name. He goes by Footwork King on Twitter. And I think the first thing is, is that he did want to clarify that he doesn't feel that any of Nikhil Harry's shortcomings this year have anything to do with Cam Newton or Cam Newton's play or anything like that. Uh, you know, there, this was a difficult season for first-year teammates. There was no training camp. Uh, there was abbreviated training camp, I should say. There was no OTAs. There was no install. There was nothing like that in the offseason because they just had to hit the ground running. And due to COVID, it was really the only time that Nikhil and Cam Newton got together before we got into camp in August was that three days at UCLA over the summer where they were able to throw against air. You know, there's no defense out there. There's no, there's no opponent wow. as, you know, trying to figure each other out. And then on top of that, it's also, you know, Cam's iteration of this offense going into place and things like that as well. And how different that was from everything that New England was running last year with Tom Brady. So a lot of changing parts in an off season that was difficult to have that much change. Uh, the one thing that I did, I do think Rashad, you know, rightfully pointed out with Nikhil is that last year he kind of felt like Nikhil's confidence had been shot by how much he struggled as a rookie. And when you really look at the college game, you know, these guys, they come up, these first round picks especially, uh, they go off in college, right? They have great college stats, they have great college production, and then they get to the pros and they get humbled a little bit. You know, they, they go against some pro competition, they get humbled. And I think what Rashad was saying was ultimately where he lines up against somebody and he says, you know, I'm going to be a problem against you today. Physically I'm going to impose my will against you and not more so than anything to do with the quarterback is what Rashad is looking for at a cam or at a Nikhil, excuse me, uh, moving forward is that Des Bryant alpha male type of personality, because we know Nikhil can win 50, 50 balls. We know he can use his size, uh, but consistently oh, sure. showing that sort of alpha dog type of uh, mentality is something that I think that is missing from his game right now. Yeah, absolutely. And, and Cam Newton has been one of his biggest supporters all season long through all of the doubt that from the outside world and the media 